Today we're going to review how to translate algebraic sentences into algebraic expressions. So to begin doing that, we need to review all of the words and phrases that have to do with translating algebra sentences into algebraic expressions. So let's think about the words that we know that represent addition. So for addition, we have the words sum, total, plus, increased by, and more than that all represent addition. For subtraction, we have the words difference, minus, decreased by, less than, and subtracted from. For multiplication, we have times, product, of, twice, twice means times two, double, which is also times two, and triple, which is times three. For division, our words are quotient, separate, divided by, and half, which is dividing by two, and third, which is dividing by three. We will need to use parentheses when we see phrases like this, times the sum of, or times the difference of slash between. Turnaround phrases are when we need to turn the order around. So when we read the sentence, we actually have to turn the order around in which it was given to us in the sentence. The turnaround phrases that we need to remember are less than, and subtracted from. So for number one, the product of a number and three. Product means multiply. This is three times n. I'm choosing n as my number. So three times n is the same thing as three n. This is also the same thing as n three. However, we normally see it like this. This is normally how you will see it, three in the front, because the variable is usually the second thing that you see in multiplication. The reason why we can reverse this order is simple. We have two times three, which is six, and we also have three times two, which is six. So you see here that for multiplication, the order does not matter. For number two, the difference between a number and 10. Difference means minus a number. We're going to let be the letter N. So N minus 10. The quotient means divide the quotient of a number N and negative five. So N divided by negative five. This, is also, this also can be written as N over negative five. This is another way to say divide. Four subtracted from a number. 
So remember, subtracted from is one of our turnaround phrases. For is first, but the turnaround phrase means we have to reverse the order, turn the order around. N minus four is read four subtracted from a number. The sum of twice a number and seven, so sum is plus, twice a number is two times a number, so two n. The sum is between the twice a number and seven, so two n plus seven. The product, again, we're talking about multiplication of a number and 10, this is 10 n is increased, so again, it's plus, by one. So plus one. So please pause this video and give number seven and eight a try on your own. When you're done with number seven and eight, unpause the video and come back to see if you got your answer right. So number seven, we're looking for four less than a number squared. So less than, remember, is a turnaround phrase. So we have to put the second part first. A number squared is n squared. Less than is minus, and we are subtracting 4. So the answer is n squared minus 4. Twice a number divided by 5. Twice a number, remember, is 2 times a number. 2 times a number divided by 5 can be written this way, or 2n divided by 5 can also be written the 